All right, today I want to just start with a simple question. Is life giving you everything that you really want? Or do you feel maybe a little let down? Do you think that God or the cosmos or somebody out there owes you something? The problem isn't that we have longings or feel dissatisfied. The problem is that we try to fulfill these longings on our own. We're trying to look for the good life in all the wrong places, addictive behaviors, the pursuit of success. All of it leads to this sense of frustration. And maybe that's what you've been feeling. Well, pay attention to that feeling because I believe it's from God. I believe that he has put that dissatisfaction in you. See, there are three longings built into every human heart. And we're going to break those down in this video. First, we're all looking for love. Maybe you've heard of this guy, Glenn Wolf. He holds the record for the most marriages in U.S. history. 29 marriages. But if you look at his life, I'll put a link below, you'll realize he wasn't very happy. In fact, none of his wives and none of his kids even came to his funeral. But this desire for love, for connection is built into each one of us. Genesis 2 in the Bible, it says, The Lord God said, it is not good for the man to be alone. This was after he had created Adam and he realized Adam needed companionship and that's when he created Eve. First John 4 says this, God showed how much he loved us by sending his one and only son into the world. And this is real love, that he loved us and sent his son Jesus as a sacrifice to take away our sins. Do you recognize this longing for connection, for love in your life? It can only truly be fulfilled in God through Jesus Christ. That's the first thing. Here's the second longing built in all of us. We all want our lives to matter. Look at the words that God spoke to Jeremiah in the Old Testament. He was a prophet. And God said, I knew you before I formed you in your mother's womb. Before you were born, I set you apart. Isn't that just a longing in every one of us? We have this deep desire to know that we have a purpose in this life. And only through God can we find that kind of purpose, no matter who you are. Maybe you've heard of Ted Turner, the media mogul. He was always working for this sense of accomplishment and success. At one point, he looked up to heaven and he said, is this good enough, dad? We try to find our accomplishment in working ourselves to death. But in the end, there's something more to life. The answer is found in the Bible. In Ephesians Chapter 2, it says, For we are God's masterpiece. He created us anew in Christ Jesus so that we can do the good things that he planned for us long ago. The only way to fulfill this longing for purpose that's built into every human heart is through a connection to the creator of the universe, the one who created us for a purpose in this life. Here's the third longing built into your heart. We all need to know why. You know, why pain? Why suffering? Why evil in this world? Philosophers and theologians have debated this for centuries, and it seems like there are certainly no easy answers to this one. But we've all experienced these existential questions. But the Bible offers at least a hint to the answers in the first chapter when it said that God looked over everything that he had made and he saw that it was very good. In other words, God created everything good. Sin and evil entered the world through the choices of human beings when Adam and Eve grabbed that first piece of fruit and decided to go with their opinion over God's opinion. That's when human suffering entered the world. It's because we reject God. But God did something to fix this fundamental problem of evil and suffering in the world. And he sent Jesus into the world to die for us and put an end to the suffering. Bonhoeffer said it like this, only the suffering God can help. The Apostle Paul said it like this in 2 Corinthians 5, God made Christ who never sinned to be the offering for our sin so that we could be made right with God through Christ. And this right here is the essence of the good news of the Bible. And it's the only real answer to the three longings built into every human heart. Is life giving you everything you want? It can only do that through Jesus Christ and a relationship with him.